Item number, SCP-905. Object class, safe. Special containment procedures. SCP-905 is to be contained in a 6 meter by 6 meter by 3 meter containment cell, painted matte black. This cell is to be devoid of any mirrors or windows. Two LED arrays are to be installed in cells housing SCP-905. Every four hours, SCP-905 is to be fed for 20 minutes. As of current regulation on misters, SCP-905 is to be contained in Hall of Sight. Description SCP-905 is a sentient entity composed of photons. These photons form a humanoid shape that has been described as fuzzy, but definite. It is roughly 1.75 meters tall. However, its mass is immeasurable. SCP-905 has shown the ability to speak through the manipulation of air particles, but its mechanism to perform this is unknown. SCP-905 is capable of the same movement as a human male of the same body structure, but due to its photonic nature, is unable to manipulate solid objects, aside from emitting weak electromagnetic radiation. Solids such as doors must be moved for SCP-905 before it can leave or enter a room. SCP-905 has the ability to pass through windows and other transparent objects. The photons SCP-905 is composed of follow the usual laws of probability in this case, and will reflect back from the transparent object at a rate of roughly 5%, separating any reflected photon from SCP-905's influence. SCP-905 describes this as painful but bearable. SCP-905 sheds its photons at a constant rate of approximately 0.001% of its body volume per second. These photons are emitted at a wavelength of roughly 380 nanometers to roughly 780 nanometers, or within the human spectrum of visible light. SCP-905 shows the ability to change the wavelengths emitted to match its background. SCP-905's lack of a shadow can make detecting SCP-905 while hidden problematic. SCP-905 shows an inability to absorb colored lights. Due to SCP-905's constant loss of photons, SCP-905 must be fed regularly in order to maintain a healthy body volume. Conversely, Feeding SCP-905 too large an amount of photons causes SCP-905 to experience an oversaturation. SCP-905 finds this extremely painful and describes it in a similar manner to human burns. Placing a mirror near SCP-905 in an attempt to feed SCP-905 its own emissions results in SCP-905 expressing extreme discomfort. When questioned, SCP-905 replied, Would you enjoy eating your own- SCP-905 was discovered at the data expunged entrance of site- Addendum 9051 The words, Mr. Chameleon, from Little Misters, by Dr. Wondertainment, are printed upon SCP-905's left calf. SCP-905 shows an inability to change the wavelength emitted by this print. Lesson complete. If you missed the previous orientation, go watch SCP-904, a short poem, right now. Or for the complete course, watch this playlist.